，我想。Day? Hmm? Don't worry, honey. It happens to us all. Hmm? Oh. You're one of those minstrel types, are you? Look, if it's money you want, you'd better go and hassle someone else. I haven't got a penny to give you. Sorry, darling. No can do. It's against my policy to leave people all alone. And they look as down in the dumps as you do. <sighs> look, why don't you just tell me what's on your mind? A problem shared is a problem half. Hmm? That's better. Now we can talk properly. Silvando, entertainer extraordinaire at your service. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, my name's Tetsu. I'm a blacksmith from Hotter, though I haven't been back in a long old while. I'll tell you my story if you really want, but I'm warning you, it doesn't have a happy ending. After all those years away, I thought it was time for me to finally head home, see how my mother was doing, you know. But then the minute I set out on my journey, Yggdrasil fell. That just made me even more desperate to get back, of course. I was so worried about her. I managed to make it as far as Gondolia, but then my luck finally ran out. My luggage was stolen by a gang of thieves who've been terrorizing the town. The Beastly Boys, they call themselves. I can't make the journey to Hotto without all my things. 
especially not the lilies of the valley I bought for my mother. They're her favorite flower. I wanted to give them to her to say, well, to say sorry for being away for so long, for leaving her all alone. <laughs> oh, honey, believe me, I know exactly how you feel. Fear not, friend. Your mother will get her flowers. Dave and I will make sure of that. All you need to do is tell us where we can find these beastly boys. Oh, well, if you're sure, there are two merchants, brothers, who run establishments in the southern part of town. I've heard that the beastly boys have been hanging around causing trouble at the older one's store. A stall in the south of town, huh? All right, we'll be back before you know it. Dave, darling, let's roll! W wait Look, I appreciate you trying to help me, but these are real thugs we're talking about here. And no offense, but you're just an entertainer, right? I wouldn't want you getting hurt. <laughs> oh, don't you worry about me, sweetie. I'm more than just a pretty face, you know? You don't mind? What we gonna do with this horrible lot then, Sylv? Well, beastly they may be, but they're not exactly the dangerous thugs we heard about. They can barely swing a sword. What's your story, boys, huh? We didn't start out as criminals. We were fishermen, and very happy fishermen at that. But after Yggdrasil fell, we couldn't take the boats out anymore. Have you seen the sea lately? It's swarming with monsters. Things were just impossible. Most days, we barely had anything to eat. The world might as well have ended that day. Lost our families. Lost everything. And no one came to help us. So we had to choose between a life of crime or starving to death. And 
that's no choice at all. Watch closely, darlings. This is just an ordinary steel pike, yes? Mm hmm Think again! <laughs> From arms to... Mm. Who's for fresh bread, huh? <gasps> <laughs> bon appetit, beastly boys! Eat your fill and forget your wicked ways. You'll be beaming again before you know it. Wait! Who... Who are you? Nobody. Just someone who likes to see people smile. They're still in one piece. Now I can go home to my mother with my head held high. Thank you, Mr. Silvando. Oh, here. It's not much, but I want you to have these. Oh, Tetsu, darling. Whatever they are, I'm sure they're wonderful. <laughs> You're such a sweetie. Honestly, you deserve much more. Come and visit me in Hotto sometime. I'll be able to thank you properly. Now, I'd better be off. I'd tell you to be careful, but I've got a feeling you'll be just fine. Bye for now. <laughs> ta -da. Yeah, you all right, Silk? Oh, I'm better than all right, darling. I found it. My purpose in life. My raison d'etre! You know how I've been so down in the dumps thinking about all the despair and suffering in the world? Well, if that's what's making me so unhappy, there's only one thing to do about it. Get out there and fix the problem. Just because I can't save the world with some grand heroic gesture, that doesn't mean I can't do it one smile at a time. That's my Sylve. I'm with you all the way. Hmm. We heard everything you just said. Huh? This them tea leaves from before. I hope they ain't spoiling for another fight. Didn't they learn a lesson first time round?
You have to let us come with you. You have to let us help people. We're done with our life of crime, thanks to you. You want to tag along? Hmm. Well, I hope you understand it won't be easy. I can't guarantee you'll get home in one piece. We don't care! Hmm. Well, in that case, welcome aboard, darlings! Now, as luck would have it, I've got you all a welcome gift. Here, take one each now. Don't be greedy. Wow. <laughs> oh, they're simply fabulous. <laughs> Darlings, you look splendid. I don't get it, Steve. What are they? They're the presents dear old Tetsu gave us. If we're going to be traveling around spreading happiness and laughter, we'll need to look the part, no? All right, we're all set. Let's get out there and bring some sunshine back into the world. <laughs> Silvando's super special smile spreading parade starts right here.
Is that all you got?